Yo, no one has asked for this video, but I'm here to show you my workout routine. And at the end, I'll be sharing a yummy, yummy recipe. Anyways, so this this will be a workout routine that will consist of two days. The first day will be more concerned with the waist, the tummy area, all that, the midsection area. And um, the next day, which will be tomorrow, it will be mainly on building muscles. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, let's do this. <laughs> So guys, the first thing I do is warm up, which is very important. And my warm up for today was keeping the rope. And um, yeah, so I'm just trying to get the hang of things right there. So I try to jump for five minutes, but two minutes in, my legs give up, lol. So after the warm up, I get straight into the workout. So these are leg raises and this helps with the abdominal area or it's normally called the fupa. So it helps in toning that area. So I do 20 reps, 3 sets of this. I do planks and side planks next and let me tell you this is one exercise that gives me a headache and um, please uh, excuse my mat I don't have a mat that's a sleeping bag but it still serves you know <laughs> I tried. <laughs> now you're going to be there. Side plank. So I'm not really sure if you're going to be seeing me, but whatever. Next thing I'm going to be doing a bicycle and a rest of flutter kicks. Okay. So guys, I ended up doing uh, crunches instead of bicycles because I found that crunches are more challenging and you know I love challenges. Yeah. So I did them. In case I didn't say this, I am in no way a personal trainer, a gymnast, or you know those people who went to school to somewhere at this uh -uh, period. I'm probably doing all the exercises wrong, but if you're a personal trainer and you want to take me as a project, Please contact me. I'm ready. Well, is it really me who has done the exercises without trying to kill myself? Um, you know, that's where my speciality is at. And so here I was trying a head stand. And sis, please do not try this if you don't know what you're doing. Or else your neck is gonna snap. And my favorite is a split and um, this acts as a cool down. I just enjoy myself.
Strength training or weight lifting is normally my favorite day slash leg day. Um, I don't know why. I really love the pain that comes with it. It's really satisfying. And the funny thing is I do not even sweat as much as um, when I'm doing like HIIT or cardio. Um, yeah, so I really hope I'm giving someone uh, encouragement to start working out, you know. <laughs> And in case someone out there does not know what this exercise is called, it's known as lunges. Whoopsie! I almost broke my leg, so you should be careful when you're lifting weights. Very, very careful. So next, I go in with the glute bridges, and this really helps with the glutes in farming and, you know, growing, I guess. <laughs> So in my next exercise, I go in with my resistance bands. I don't really know what this exercise is called, but it helps with the hamstrings and also the glutes. And let me tell you, it burns. It really, really burns. But a good kind of burn. <laughs> So next up, I do some donkey kicks and I use a resistant band and a resistant band helps the exercises to be more challenging but more effective and that's the goal, you know. And by the way guys, I increase the speed of the video so I don't really do the exercises that quick because I really need to make sure that my form is correct. I don't want, you know, um, some injuries here and there. And still, I'm a beginner. Okay, not really a beginner but let's say an intermediate that is from a beginner level. <laughs> And now these are my favorite. They are known as the hip thrust. Almost um, the same with the glute bridges, but now the difference is that this you should be your shoulders should be on the couch. So guys, kindly do not do this, cause um, I almost broke my back trying to lift that. You know what is it called attire and okay it's not really heavy but i was doing this exercise completely wrong my form was very off so not unless there's a personal trainer around please um be careful now it's time for that creamy bean recipe filled with proteins and your muscles well, thank you for this. So that's both red onions and spring onions into hot oil and some salt to taste. Garlic and ginger paste in it. So after they've turned golden brown, you put in the tomatoes and the bell peppers. So you add the spices, some regular cube, turmeric, beef masala, salt, and some black pepper i can't find where my mom put the rest so i'm using the one that is in the blender so this is how it looks after adding the spices i would have put some soy sauce and vinegar but i'm not going into that direction um yeah so you wait for the tomatoes to soften and mash then we go to the next step so this is how it, they look and now I go in with my frozen beans. I'm not going to put all of them because this is just my food. So guys, after stirring, um, you close the, with the lid. Then you wait for it to simmer in low heat. 
so that each and every what do you say each and every whatever to guys i meant all the spices sip in so at this point i go in with my whole milk specifically cow milk from the brand brookside and guys talk about animal protein and plant protein coming together hey my goodness this is the best and if you are allergic to cow protein or animal products in general you can use um, almond milk or coconut milk yeah exactly so guys this is how it looks and look at that i'm telling you the camera is not doing it justice but she's thick so you let it simmer and you can add some water if you would like or just eat it this way Ooh. protein protein so this is basically what i'll be having after my workout that's coffee right there and please subscribe if you haven't already we are growing more than weeds in a garden like this video share comment down below and tell me what other videos you'd like to see bye oopsie i forgot to give you a kiss Mwah!